Hello, my name is Carly Rich. I'm the dominatrix Ms. Barbie Bitch. I have two children, a son, uh, married, who turned 25 yesterday. His wife is going to law school. She's in her second year. My son fights for the MMA. My daughter is uh, going to school for environmental engineering and marrying an RCMP officer. The reason I'm running for mayor is I think that our city right now needs to, to get a hold of some bad behavior that's been happening and we need to focus on political issues and not what's happening outside of the arena. For me, I feel that there's demographics that we don't hear from and that don't stand up enough and that's the one thing that for me that I would like to do. I'd like to take care, I'd like to take care of certain social issues and stuff like that. I feel that we're having more, we're bringing more issues into the city instead of fixing some of the issues that's dragging the city down. So that's why I'm running. First three things. Number one, I am all for the metronome and building and revamping some of the waterway right there. Definitely. Environmental issues for me are huge. I don't know why more buildings are self-sustaining. There's a lot of rooftop. You want another hydro failure? And then a definite thing that I would do is uh, for children's nutrition programs. My mom implemented all those nutrition programs and Ford, that's one of the things that he cut, saying that they were useless. Corrupt the child right from the very beginning and don't give that child the same, uh, those advantages. You're going to turn around and breed and make a child that uh, clearly is, is not gonna have advantages in life. Go after the parents who don't pay child support. It is an issue, create jobs in that sector as well, going after them. Uh, create jobs in certain sectors for, for animal cruelty and stuff. More of those officers and more of that, those jobs that step up and help people either off of welfare or get slightly better paying jobs and, slight, and more obtainable jobs. But I know exactly what it's like to, number one, to fight for every dollar that you have. You know, to have, to have things that have either been taken from you because of who you are in society and not for the value that you have. I mean, a dominatrix, number one, doesn't lie on their back. The value of a dominatrix is dressed and on their feet.